back to KB Wrestling, KB Wrestling, or you can call me Kyle, and I'm with Lou Guppy Boys and Mr. Yolo. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Yolo over there. Um, today's episode is gonna be about. You look so hipster right now. <laughs> yeah, dude. Let's get it. <laughs> um, this episode is about. I'm not sure how true it is, but I know there's been a lot of other people that uploaded about it and reports about. Vince McMahon stepping uh, not all the way out of WWE, but just a little back and letting Triple H have more control. So, uh, uh, reportedly, 205 Live, the Cruiserweights, is being completely run by Triple H now and not Vince McMahon. Which you could probably tell since they're having another tr tournament for the belt that's going to end at WrestleMania. And um, that was... an idea of Triple H when it first came before like 205 Live when they introduced the Cruiserweights for the Cruiserweight Classic Tournament and um <laughs> sorry yeah Mr. Yellow just being amazing and uh love Mr. Yellow to me. yeah subscribe to that man <laughs> but anyways Triple H has full control over the Cruiserweights uh, reportedly and um <laughs> And, uh, yeah. And Triple H might have more control over WWE since, um, Vince McMahon is supposed to be stepping back a little bit since XFL. He's wearing it backwards. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Mr. O is just being a distraction off cam. And, uh, as you can tell by Little Guppy. Little Guppy's face. Yes, but uh, yeah, Triple H is being given more control reportedly since um, Vince McMahon is supposed to be stepping back a little bit because of you know in the next <laughs> in the next two years he's supposed to be uh, do oh, bring back the XFL twenty twenty. Can't wait for that. I know you can't wait for that. That's probably why he's stepping down a little bit from um. Yeah, you know. that's that's the report why he's stepping back a little bit just so he couldn't do that in other stuff with Alpha Entertainment. And Triple H, now, it's, a, it's kind of a good thing that Triple H is gaining more control because he's been able to make all your favorite superstars on NXT, how awesome they are. And then uh, he likes to showcase people's talents, unlike Vince, who doesn't right away showcase people's talents, but he likes people. Roman Reigns. Yeah. Roman Reigns. <laughs> Roman Reigns, uh, John Cena for years and years. Um, but hopefully now with Triple H gaining reportedly more control, may, uh, Raw and SmackDown, wherever he may be running stuff, 205 Live even should be a lot better than what we've seen with Vince running it. But keep in mind, Vince isn't completely leaving. He's just stepping back a little bit, giving more control to Triple H. Because keep in mind, Vince is 71, I think. And uh, he is doing other stuff like XFL and Alpha Entertainment. So... That's pretty much what I wanted to update you guys about and what I wanted to let you guys know about since we could see better stuff in the future since Triple H is gaining more control of WWE. So with that said, that's it for the video guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. And if you are already subs subscribed, you guys are amazing, too sweet. And subscribe to Little Guppy. Subscribe to Mr. Yellow 28. Yep, and subscribe to Mr. Yellow 28. They are awesome. And, uh, oh, uh, Collar and Elbow. If you guys want to buy any of their merch, this hat is great, especially their shirts. Uh, use code KB, KBWD free, KB, KBWDFREE -E to save 10% on your purchase at collarandelbow.com. So, with that said, remember, guys, it's YouTube. Stay drama-free. Peace. Stay drama-free. Stay drama-free. Oh.